U.S. stocks rose across the board Monday, helped by Facebook parent Meta Platforms, which gained 2% after broker Loop Capital upgraded the shares to buy from hold. The Dow added about one-tenth of 1%, the S&P 500 climbed three-tenths, and the tech-heavy Nasdaq rose two-thirds of 1%. Large technology stocks continue to provide a lift to U.S. markets. But Contigo Global Director of Applied Research Melissa Brown says that kind of lift is unlikely to last. At this kind of narrow breath, this, you know, this leadership that is really focused on a few names is really unsustainable. And so over, you know, it may not, you know, happen tomorrow, but at some point, some of the, these stocks, which are already a huge part, at least of the U.S. market, um, they... That doesn't tend, you know, at least historically, that hasn't tended to continue. Um, how do, so how do they become not as big a part of the U.S. market? Well, they have to come down. Those stocks have to come down. Investors are watching talks over the debt ceiling, with President Joe Biden scheduled to meet with Republican Speaker of the House Kevin McCarthy and others Tuesday. The U.S. Treasury Department said late Monday it still expects to be able to pay the U.S. government's bills only through June 1st without a debt limit increase. While economic data out this week includes retail sales and an update on the housing market, on Monday, several Federal Reserve officials indicated they expect interest rates to stay high at odds with market expectations for a rate cut before the end of the year.